Get this run underway! Add marker to Twitch. So, we're going to start off with the first one. And we're going to take this run at a very slow, methodical pace. Um, uh, we've got no release dates to catch up to for the next Assassin's Creed. We've got nothing like that to hold us down to when we've got to be like done by. So we're going to take a nice slow pace and try and assassinate everything and not go in just guns blazing, counter everything. Even though it's probably going to end up that way. So we're going to go new. At least I would, but first of all I'm going to go into options because apparently how they've done this is beyond me. I don't know what you mean, you and Jiffy. Yeah, you did. So they've mapped out the controller for me because like, I've picked controller. Square is select. <laughs> and circle's not back. Triangle's back. Why is triangle back? <laughs> New game. Right, quickly, because apparently you can only adjust your audio when you're in here. There we go. I apply my <laughs> X is punch. And to no madness and folly, I perceived that this also was a chasing up the wind. Very much wisdom, very much grief. We've got a problem. I can't anchor him to the memory. Too much psychological trauma. He's rejecting the treatment, retreating. Uh, Desmond, I need you to try and relax. Let me try and stabilize. <gasps> This is gonna be a rough playthrough. <laughs> I can tell already. Recognize that what you're seeing isn't real. Can we have the uh, switcher turned on, please? It can't hurt you. Damn it! It's not working. Give it a moment, Mister. What's the point? Quickly before I go in. Was there not subtitles? Are you serious? There's no subtitles? Is it in graphics? Please tell me you're in graphics. You're not. There's no subtitles in this game. So I hope all the sound stuff we did the other day works perfectly. That's enough, Mr. Man. We need to pull him out. Now. Alright, Desmond. We're going to try and bring you out now. I can hear all nice clear so far. That's good. I told you. I just wish there was subtitles. Bastards! Now, now, I just saved your life. Saved my life? You kidnapped me. You strapped me into that thing. Animus. At least we get the it's worst animus. one out of the way first. I don't even know you people. Why are you doing this to me? You have information we need, Mr. Miles. Because we can, and we're a bunch of dicks. I'm a bartender for Christ. <laughs> no sign language on TV. What do you want me to do? Teach you how to mix a martini? We know who you are, what you are. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play coy with me. There isn't time. You're an assassin, and whether you realize it or not, you've got something that my employers want locked away in that head of yours. 
But I'm not an assassin. Not anymore. Yes, your file indicates. <laughs> yes, much. I would watch that. Something about an escape. Most. Try and make sign language. That makes a. <laughs> what do you I am not me? a uh, assassin you anymore. <laughs> the animus will allow us to locate. Do what you we need. understand me? Once we have it, you'll be free to go. I am not going back in there. Then we'll induce a coma and continue our work. When we're done, you'll be left to die. Truth be told, the only reason you're still conscious is because this approach saves us time. You're insane. So what is it, Mr. Miles? Live or die? Choices. Lie down. A wise decision. Whoa. Where am I? You're inside the Animus. Which is... It's a projector that renders genetic memories in three Can we remember... Genetic what memories. buttons were on the console for this game? Because I certainly well. don't. We'll start simple. What is a memory? Mr. Miles, it's the recollection of a past event. Nope. Specific to the individual remembering the event. So I'm trying to remember. Yeah, sure. <laughs> what if I told X you definitely you wasn't punch, was it? An individual's memory but on the, the Xbox term A. Ancestors as well. Genetic memory, if you will. Migration, hibernation, reproduction. How do animals know when and where to go? What to do? That's just animal instinct. Now you're arguing semantics, Mr. Miles. Whatever you call it, it was X on the Xbox? Remains. These creatures hold knowledge absent the requisite first hand experience. So, PlayStation turns up square. To understand why. I discovered something most fascinating. Our DNA functions as an archive. It contains not only genetic instructions passed down from previous generations, but memories as well. The memories of our ancestors. And the Animus lets you decode and read these DNA files. Precisely. But Just learning about the entire premise of the game right this now. This is the specific memory we're trying to access. Unfortunately, when we try and open the memory, your mind withdraws. You lack the confidence to step into your ancestor's body. That's what happened earlier. You got knocked out of the target memory and pushed back to a more stable state. Why? It's your subconscious. It's resisting. We found similar reactions among patients who undergo hypnosis to relive traumatic events. They can't jump directly into the specific memory. They need to be eased in. Even then, there can be problems. So how do we fix it? We find a memory you can synchronize with, and we move forward from there. You'll get used to it. This is the closest we can get, so it's where we'll have to start. I'm uploading the tutorial program now. Okay, in we go. I'm trying to figure out these buttons. This is going to be the battle in of itself. Buttons. Warning. Data stream unstable. Attempting to restore synchronization. Hello, Subject 17. This tutorial has I'm pretty sure that was X. To better but that's not X on this. Control system. Instructions will follow shortly. <laughs> The synchronization bar represents how in sync you are with your ancestors' memories. If you ever fall completely out of sync, the Animus will restore you to your last synchronized position. You are currently dangerous. He is hoping it gets better buttons or an easy to understand layout when it comes to Assassin's Creed 2. To restore system stability. The Animus utilizes a puppeteering concept to control the actions of your ancestor. <laughs> Even then, it doesn't line up! It says blend at the bottom! To the animus. We will begin. Right. <laughs> One more. So I want feet to be X. Okay. Customize controls. That, I want to be that. So select that to be button 1. And I back out. Eat input. Vision to be triangle. Options. Customize controller. Vision to be triangle. And I've lost the rest. <laughs> While standing still, 
Use the head button to observe your environment. Hold on. So I see closed off hand and open hand. So open hand wants to be that, and closed hand wants to be that. Right. The hell's a hat switch? What's a hat switch? Well, oh, that feels better. That feels so much better. Good. Use your empty hand to walk through these jar carriers without causing them to drop what they're holding. Proceed to the mark. Gentle push. Do that. No problem. Process. Let me flow through. Just get on my way. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, that feels so much better now. I just gotta figure out what my triggers do. Well done. L1's run. I feel like it, uh, that was it on PlayStation. Between two fundamental actions. Low profile and high profile. Low profile actions are socially acceptable. What's button high five? High profile actions are more action oriented. Hold the high profile button to see how you Fruity! Hello, how are you doing? Changes the context of the puppeteering inputs. Excellent. I'm guessing our one's button five. Let's double check this. Yes, our one's button five. We'll continue your synchronization process. By is this the yes? It's the very first one. We're going through doing a marathon run. We're playing all the Assassin's Creed games back to back. Um, and we're starting from now. Pretty good, mate. I'm doing fantastic. Today is our so wait holder and six to grab. Okay. Um, we are uh, uh, doing good. Today is our four year anniversary of streaming, two year anniversary on Mixer. And I was starting our Assassin's Creed Marathon run today as well. Where you can, if you wanted to, that t-shirt you just seen pop up in the corner over there is, is a limited edition that we're selling. Just installing the bundle, do you have any idea what magic... I think that's the company stuff. Um, I haven't properly done that myself yet, darling. But if you wait on... As long as you've purchased the bundle, you should know. Google knows. If you wait till after the stream, I'll sort both yours and mine out at the same time. Because I bought myself the bundle as well. Grab and why does it look like we're stuck in a loop? Why are I wearing my T-shirt? It's my uniform. I'm not wearing it, so I can then pick it up and just very easily show it off without looking like I'm undressing. That's why I am wearing it. I get the feeling we may be bugged. What do you all think? Oh, you can stand up a little and show it off? I could. Okay. <gasps> We've been through all this. I told you he'd be fine. Bastards! Now, now, I just... Oh, we have to listen to him again. Saved my life? You kidnapped me. You strapped me into that thing. Animus. It's an animus. I don't even know you people. Why are you doing this to me? You have information we need, Mr. Miles. And there's no such thing as standing up a little here. Like, the I'm most I can do is go, for Christ's Look. sakes. What do you want me to do? Teach you how to mix a martini? We know who you are. What you are. <laughs> I can't I don't skip. know what you're talking about. Don't play coy with me. There isn't time. You're an assassin. And whether you realize it or not, you've got something that my employers want. Are you seeing flashing images? That head of yours. But I'm not an assassin. Not anymore. 
Yes, your file indicated as much. Something about an escape. Most fortunate for us. What do you want from me? For you to do as you're told. The Animus will allow us to locate what we need. Once we have it, you'll be free to go. He's a mess the first time he there. changed to Animus. Then we'll induce a coma and continue our work. When we're done, you'll be left to die. Truth be told, the only reason you're still conscious is because this approach saves us time. Uh -huh. That's insane. So what is it, Mr. Miles? Live or die? Actor messes his lines. Lie down. A wise decision. Imagine if we just didn't press a button at that point and it's just like, and you die. Game over. Where am I? You're inside the Animus. Which is... It's a projector that renders genetic memories in three May I have to see if this is on box capability? It memory. is cheese. Seems I can tell you right now. Tutorial. Very well. You can play we'll start every soon. Assassin's Creed what game that I am playing in this marathon it's the on Xbox One. Of a past event. Specific to the individual Backwards compatibility or remastered. Yeah, sure. What if I told you that the human body not only housed an individual's memory, but the memories of his ancestors as well? Genetic memory, if you will. Migration, hibernation, reproduction. Yes, yeah. I could How literally go onto my Xbox right now go, and just show you the entire you list. That's just animal instinct. Now you're arguing semantics, Mr. Miles. You have to get the first Whatever one again as someone uh, has borrowed it and never gave it back. That's why I don't want to do discs anymore. These creatures hold knowledge Still got the discs for all the others. I don't, I don't do discs anymore. I've spent the past 30 years trying to understand why. I discovered something That's why I'm slightly upset with uh, Streamlabs. As an archive. Because obviously Streamlabs has updated the whole tip page thing that we showed off before. So now if you go to the tip page of the murder room, you see it's kind of like a website-y thing now. And I was looking all over that, and I couldn't find the wish lists. Precisely. So I tweeted at Streamlabs yesterday, being like, "Yo, this website and everything for the query websites are pretty cool, but uh, where's wish lists?" And they were like, "Yeah, we're getting rid of them." I'm like, "Oh." Your wish list was pretty much the only way to tell people what kind of games I was after without them like gifting me a physical copy. Awesome! Let's double check Amazon, the only other place I do wish lists on. Oh, I can find all the games I'm after. Physical copies. Well, shit. So how do we fix it? We find a memory you can synchronize with, and we move forward from there. You'll get used to it. This is the closest we can get, so it's where we'll have to start. I'm uploading the tutorial program now. Warning. Data stream unstable. Attempting to restore synchronization. Ah. Hello, Subject 17. This tutorial has been prepared in order to better acclimate you to the Animus's control system. Instructions. Right, hopefully it doesn't break on us this time. The synchronization bar represents how in sync you are with your ancestors' memories. If you ever fall completely out of sync, the Animus will restore you to your last synchronized position. You are currently dangerously close to desynchronization. Please follow all forthcoming instructions in order to restore system stability. The Animus utilizes a puppeteering concept to control do, the do, do, do. of your answer. Well, for the very first, it sure looks good. I'm we are on PC and I've bumped all the graphics and everything up. Adaptation to the Animus. We will begin by exploring the default actions of each input. The look of the Assassin's Creed game, like this, the first one, its flaw wasn't its looks. The first still, game, its flaw was its repetitiveness. That if you watch us play through this game, you'll experience. Once you've done one city, you've basically done all cities. Good. The only difference is who you're killing. Um, very similar thing to what uh, Mad Max suffers from. Proceed to the marker to continue the synchronization process. Each mission was the same, at least. Yeah, that was the downside of Assassin's Creed 1. It's just way too repetitive. Like, you literally went to a new city and it was just like, right, 
Do all the same things you did last time and to yeah, unlock yeah. the guy you got to kill. Right, now you know where he's going to be, so go kill him. Right, kill him, now run away from guards. Two it was just repeat that over and over and over again until you pretty much go to the final area, and it was just like, right, now I'm going to start changing things up a little. <laughs> socially acceptable. High-profile actions are more action-oriented. Hold the high-profile button to see how your heads-up display changes the context of the puppeteering inputs. Excellent. Was still a great game, and Sarah. It was, but it also got a lot of a uh, bad mouth on it for its repetitiveness and endurance time, especially when two came out. Two and Brotherhood kind of basically saved the Assassin's Creed franchise. Throw the man into the marker. Good. Using your legs button in high profile Here we go. will allow you to sprint. Sprinting first game, first attempt trying to... It, exactly. To now we have to sprint. To We're actually getting progress, boys! Be careful not to bump into anyone, for you can lose your balance. Can I just point out what we're saying about how good this game looks, While right? Sprinting, so, like, the, the look on his clothing, everything looks amazing. Look at the top in the middle where the flashing yellow-white light is. Look how pixelated that looks. Well done. The animus will also provide other important information. Like, look at it. The social look. status icon gives you information on your social status. The different states will be explained in context soon. This icon appears when a soldier is looking at you. The yellow color means the soldier is either unaware. Doesn't even look that great in that picture. Who you are? To illustrate the change in awareness level, you will stealth assassinate this soldier. First, lock onto your target. Uh, but in four. Now select your hidden blade. That one. With your blade selected, walk up to the soldier and assassinate him by using your armed hand button. So far, the most challenging point in this game is bring out what button does what. Awareness to informed as represented by the red witness indicator. Aggressive actions or socially unacceptable behavior undertaken at this time will likely provoke an armed response. Provoke this soldier. Kill him! Kill the Notice assassin! The social status icon has changed to exposed. Use the ladder and try to break the line of sight. Okay. Come back here! Nope, see you later. Boy! Excellent. The line of sight has been broken. Now, run into the roof garden to hide from the soldier. Good. Your social status indicates that you are hidden, but the soldier is still looking for you. Wait until your social status changes again. If I remember correctly, in Assassin's Creed 1, they never ever looked in a hiding spot, did they? Well done. He just kind of ran past there and went, he can't be in there. You are now anonymous, and you can exit the hide spot. <laughs> Excellent. Awesome. I'm getting out there. Woo! Being anonymous will fill your synchronization bar and make your job as an assassin easier. There are different places which you can use to hide. However, you must always break the line of sight first. And then use a hide spot to vanish. Landing with people, dive into a hay bale, because they apparently save you breaking back and legs. Uh, roof garden, there was no garden in it. Or blending with the monks. Let us continue with a demonstration of blend. Blend can be activated with the Am I doing regular AC3 then or as uh, AC3 remastered? Remastered! We're doing remastered free. Use this to reach um, behind the soldiers. We're not gonna be doing a uh, remastered rogue or Ezio collection because all they were on the console was basically uh remastered rogue was just bringing the console version of the rogue up to the standards of PC. 
So our Assassin's Creed Rogue we have on PC is the exact same quality as the remaster. Uh, same with the Ezio collection. They were just bringing up to the PC standard. So when we play through two Brotherhood and Revelations, we're essentially going to be playing Ezio collection in a sense. Uh, yeah, sure, but I'll be coming down in a moment as well because I'm going to need a, need a bathroom. Uh, press button free while still fully synchronized. All right. All right. Ooh. Oh yeah, Eagle Vision. <sighs> Informative assassination target, a uh, soldier, and blue was ally. Remember, Eagle Vision will only be available once you are fully synced. Please note that following the Assassin's Creed, your ancestors. I would alt tab out and show you all the games that we're doing, but I don't want to break it. I want at least till we get to a checkpoint. Because like fuck, I don't want to go through all that first, first dialogue again. Never hurt an innocent person. Second. Always be discreet. Third, do not compromise the Off the top of me, let's see if I can remember them all. Should you lose sync? One, you two, Brotherhood Revelations, any DLC missions are amongst them. So like the Leonardo stuff. Uh, remastered Free, Remastered Liberations, Black Flag Gold Edition, which also means the additional missions that came with, for the last of Liberations. Um, Freedom Cry, um wait there must be another way. rogue unity unity dlc of dead kings um then after that i do believe is syndicate uh we're gonna be doing syndicate's dlc of jack the ripper you might learn something indeed uh origins along with all of origins dlcs uh, Odyssey, with well, Odyssey's current DLCs, because they're not all out yet, as well as the free Assassin's Creed Chronicle games. In total, we're going through like 17 games. It matters not how we complete our task, only that it's done. But this is not the way of- My way is better. I will scout ahead. Try not to dishonor us further. What is our mission? My brother would say nothing to me. Only that I should be honored to have been invited. The Master believes the Templars have found something beneath the Temple Mount. Treasure? I do not know. All that matters is the Master considers it important. Else he would not have asked me to retrieve it. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I just went down the ladder without meaning to. I did. Lock on to target. Uh, Assassin eight. There. That must be the arc. The arc feels really weird to be playing this game again. To be honest, no such thing. It's just a story. Then what is it? Quiet. Someone's coming. I want us through this gate before sunrise. The sooner we possess it, the sooner we can turn our attention to those jackals at Massiaf. Robert de Sable, his life is mine. Templar style. No. <laughs> We were asked to retrieve the treasure and deal with Robert only if necessary. He stands between us and it. I'd say it's necessary. Discretion, Altair! You mean cowardice. That man is our greatest enemy. And here we have a chance to be rid of him. You have already broken two tenets of our creed. Now you would break the third. Do not compromise the Brotherhood. I am your superior, in both title and ability. You should know better than to question me. Altier was a really, like, just a dick. Agar and Fucktard, pretty much, right? Hold, Templars. You are not the only ones with business here. Ah. Well, this explains my missing man. And what is it you want? Blood. No! Ah! Ah! 
You know not the things in which you meddle, Assassin. 